Hello. How are y'all? So I wanted to do an update on my spiritual journal. Bullet journal, spiritual journal, witchy journal, uh, book of mirrors. I don't know exactly what to call it, but um, <laughs> this is it. I don't have this tucked in because I have um, information in here and I'm, I try to keep like some of the things that I kind of want to put in places. Anyway, I've done some visual stuff on here that I really like. And this was a tarot card that someone sent me. Thank you, Leanne, if you're watching. And I will continue to put little things on here as I find them. I have updated most of the index. And when the new year starts, I will be recording my daily pulls. Um, these are the cards that I pulled for the year for each month. And then I will talk about them. This is my tarot and oracle cards. These are the ones that I own. This is my wish list. Um, and these include affirmation cards and things like that. And I have written what they are over to the side. Um, this is Terascopes and then my own weekly poll. I do that pretty much every week. This is some, this is a journal entry about spirituality and this was this was something that came from I think it's um, Earth Pathways that I really like that resonated with me. And this was a page based on Kelly Ann Maddox's video Creating Your Own Path and she asks you some questions and talks about some things and I wrote down some notes. And I put the date down because I did this this month in November. And I'm going to go back in and reevaluate it again later on in a few months. Notes from Drawing Down the Moon, and I will continue. I'm reading that book. Uh, the Full Moon in Aquarius. My moon sign is Aquarius, and I was actually born on a full moon, so I did this. And then this is my sun sign, which is Cancer, and I'm not done with this yet. And then I think I'm going to put the water sign right here. And then this is my rising sign, which is in Leo, my ascendant, and I'm not done with this yet. And then this is my natal chart, along with, it's called Progressions, and this was as of the 18th of November. And I'm going to write down some stuff right here, but I have not done that yet. And this is where I've been doing some moon stuff. I am a patron of Romani's. Um, I actually am in the Windfrog scene, and this was some stuff that, um, this was her PDF kind of stuff. And then I did this, and this is a general version real quick. And then these are more detailed information about the various moons. This was November. I have my cards. This is this week right here. And we're almost finished with this week. And then this is more moon stuff. More moon stuff. I need to finish doing this. Um, this is the full moon today. And I wrote down information. And then this is where moons continue. And then symbols for all different kinds of things. And then this is where I will be writing down next week for the tarot scopes and my own polls. And then this is where December starts. Well, it starts the end of the week, so that's why I have that here. And the winter solstice information, Sagittarius, the year ahead, and what the night sky will look like. And then that's it. And I just pretty much wanted to show you. I have some notes that uh, are from Romani's PDF. I'm really enjoying what I'm doing. I do want to do some more stuff in here, uh, like the, the moons for the whole year, like I have in the other one. I want to redo it maybe I'm not sure i I have a book that I want to make my moon book my book of moons and but I want to do some more study <laughs> at, before I do that and that is where I did the watercolor of the new moon and the full moon so later on tonight I will write my stuff about the full moon all the way around the moon and I will then share that and I'm really excited because I think this is really coming together it's sort of the combination of a bullet journal and a book of mirrors and 
it's yeah it's the culmination of a lot of different things um i'm do all the things i'm studying like tarot and stuff like that will also go in here i haven't been doing a whole lot of of the journaling about tarot very much except when i pull the the cards like this card the card that i pulled for this week that we're on right now is strength the uh oracle card i pulled is listen and the affirmation card was i let go which really played in with what Arwen was saying in her telescopes. So, um, so far so good. Um, this full moon in Gemini, <laughs> um, it's a doozy. And I really want to do some more stuff. Um, I hope that y'all have a good one. I'm sorry, this is a short one. <laughs> but I uh, uh, just wanted to do a flip through and kind of catch you up on some of the things that I'm doing and I'm still in research and learning and studying mode um, so this does have some art and creative uh, things to it which is just how I tend to do things and I do need to finish some things up But it, it feels like I'm headed in the right direction. These are explanations of Books of Shadows, Book of Mirrors, Book of Moons. And I'm going to write some more things down once I kind of figure some more things out. And that's, yeah, that's where I'm at. I'm doing some journaling in here. I will probably do some more art in here. I want to I really start working more on learning the tarot and the imagery and the symbolism and stuff in the tarot. So I may really soon probably really really soon start drawing more of the tarot and using my stickers and drawing them um, and start doing more daily pulls which is what I really like to do and draw the card have a sticker and draw the card and then write about it I, I may start that this coming week um, right now I'm, I was trying to get a feel for what I was doing and how I'm doing things I have since, instead of separating everything out for right now, I'm just going to put it all together in one place and I'm just going to make sure that I label things really well in the index and then that'll be that. <laughs> Thanks, for, Thanks watching. for watching and I hope you have a good one and I'll see you soon. Bye.